In my capacity as a Special Rapporteur, I believe that this project is very relevant. The efforts of the Geneva Academy, in led by Alice Pridi and, and her report, are guiding us on how to understand how both international human rights law and international humanitarian law should be um, read in conjunction. We really need to start thinking about how the Convention on the Rights of Persons with Disabilities has uh, brought light um, to how we need to redefine the rest of our international legal frameworks. For so long, persons with disabilities have been outside the scope of protection or only perceived as um, objects of care and not as citizens that deserve rights and that need uh, all sorts of protection to be able to enjoy uh, their fundamental rights on an equal basis with others. Uh, the Convention on the Rights of Persons with Disabilities changed that and together with Article 11, it brought to light the difficult situation that persons with disabilities face in, in situations of um, humanitarian emergencies and in situations of armed conflict. But together with that, we need to make a critical revision of how we are applying international humanitarian law for the protection of persons with disabilities and how to do this while also respecting and promoting the rights of persons with disabilities. This research project allows us to think in more depth about the intersections and how to move forward in a way that is going to guarantee that persons with disabilities rights are respected and protected when facing the hard and difficult situations of armed conflict.